Time to play with some clay. Okay, I'm going to be working on his ear, but not today. I, it's uh, almost 5 o'clock, and i got to go to dinner again. That's twice this week. Actually, three times in the last week. Good God. Anyway, I'll be doing the little pocket on the uh, side of the ear, on the outer edge. It's called, i got it written down, the Catanimous, no, Catanius marginal pouch, or better known as Henry's pocket. And it's in some dog's ears, not all, and it's in cat ears as well. Um, people really don't know what it does. It, it may be a receptor for higher t pitched uh, sounds and stuff like that. I don't know. And they don't know either. I mean, really, because nobody hears what a dog hears. At any rate, uh, dogs with upright ears uh, more than likely have this uh, uh, Henry's pocket in the side of their ear. Now, I had uh, people tell me that my ears are too big on this dog. And believe me, when I tell you, their ears are not small. They're very big. And uh, I'm not going to reduce the ear for that reason. Look how big those ears are. That's these, these are a Carolina dog or the American Dingo. Uh, somebody said also that uh, the nose looks like it, it's a, uh, a jackal's nose. Uh, hyena's nose and I don't think so I mean in person it looks completely different than it probably does on video uh, but I am going to probably th I'm thinking about lengthening the nose a little bit I don't know I'm just but today I can't do that because I'm go going to have to get ready for dinner now um, so I'll I'll continue this video tomorrow I'm so sorry. Yesterday was just a really, really, really bad day. It was the 13th, Thursday the 13th. And I didn't know that until late in the evening when I actually looked at the date. But it started out bad at 5 o'clock in the morning. It just, everything went wrong. Um, I get to uh, the store. I uh, wanted to... Uh, pay somebody uh, for services and uh, I went to the store to get some cash at the uh, cash machine <laughs> and and uh, I got cash I got uh, so anyway I was go, go, went back out to get in the van and I took the keys out of my pocket and the money came out with it and it went down and fell and slid right underneath the, the van. Now, I'm 74. I'll be 75 in October. And I am just not all that spry to get underneath and reach under the van to get my money. So I got in my van, started it up, pulled forward. But the wind blew the money <laughs> with my van. It just stayed right underneath my van. So I got out to... Uh, check to see if I had cleared the money and I'm sitting out in the middle of where people drive in the parking lot of the grocery store and I get out of my van it's still running and uh, the door closed and I could hear the door lock and so I'm standing there in the middle of the parking lot with my door locked my van running and my money still underneath my van and it starts raining so I'm trying to get people to help me and with this COVID thing people are all oh no 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 they go hiding off in their cars and we're just ignoring the hell out of me 
it, this ain't the Montana I know. Um, people are always helpful. Well, a couple did help me, and I got to tell you, I appreciate what they did. They, I, they didn't, couldn't take me in their car. I only wanted to go about a mile, uh, and they were going to go that way anyway. But uh, they didn't want to take a chance of getting COVID from me, who is completely healthy. But I don't blame them. They said they got, they're camping with their grandpa, and they don't want to take a chance of, uh, you know, transferring anything to him that could kill him. So I understood that, kind of. Anyway, I described a building that a friend of mine is uh, re renovating downtown Ennis, and I asked them if he, they would stop and go in. And I asked them if they would go in and get a hold of the gentleman and see if he'd come up. My cell phone was in the uh, van, so I couldn't call for any help, and these people didn't know anybody around. Uh, another couple came by um, while they were gone. I didn't want to take a chance of uh, them not finding the person I asked for, so I asked them to see, they asked if I had AAA, and they called um, a local key uh, gentleman, a guy that does it, uh, a locksmith, local guy. And my friend got to my van just as uh, this guy, the locksmith, was driving up. And uh, the locksmith took about three seconds, got my van open, and I was good. But uh, it was a fun day. Oh, and it cost me two-thirds <laughs> what I got out of the uh, uh, money machine to pay my friend, so I had to cancel paying my friend. But it uh, it was well worth uh, the the money to get that van open. Uh, it was a tough day yesterday, and I came back home, and I I you know how something doesn't go quite right, and you don't feel really right in your stomach. And that's the way I felt all day last night, yesterday until late last night. So I decided not to work on this yesterday for that reason. And I just got down here because it's uh, the sun is finally out of my studio and I can, uh, it's cooling off in here with the uh, windows open, but uh, I gotta go. Or I'll come down tonight when I get back uh, from uh, dinner. That's probably what I'll do. The people I went to dinner with tonight have a dog that uh, has stand-up ears. That they don't it doesn't have the uh, little pocket, the Henry's pocket. Not all the uh, not all dogs that have that type of ear has the pocket. But the American Dingo does. And you have to be careful because uh, if you got a dog that has that pocket, you have to be careful that they don't uh, get lice in the uh, pocket. Because lice love warm little areas like that to grow in.
Yeah, I got caught quiz. My back is hurting too much right now. Well, I got a good start for tomorrow. Still got to work out the muscles and the uh, tendons in his leg. Legs. And, uh... So I got a little ways to go yet. All right, everybody. Have a great night. And I'll see you tomorrow. Or the next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs. Uh, the link down below this video. All right. See you next time.